all right so welcome to pv tech i'm friends and in this particular video i'm gonna guide you through how you can watch some of the World Cup matches on the free platform i mean the satellite platform and then the terrestrial platform those channels that will be telecasting it for you to get access to watch it for free all right so we have the paid platform which is the dstv star time go tv if you can afford that but you have a satellite receiver which can get you any fta signal and you have a built-in plasma tv with a satellite in it which can also get you an fta channels all you got to do is to get those channels that will be telecasting the World Cup matches to get access to it all right so when it comes to a built-in plasma tv you have built-in plasma tv with those antenna ports so whenever you have a built-in plasma tv with an antenna port which means you can get access to the terrestrial channel that is available if only you are living in a location whereby you have accessibility to the terrestrial signal all right so all you got to do is to get an antenna mount and an antenna and then do the necessary connection onto your tv get a stable signal scan to get those channels that will be telecasting the world cup match so on the terrestrial option we have some local channels that will be telecasting the match selected matches not all the matches so you have metro tv gtv sports plus and then gtv you have tv3 but with the tv3 they have lock those matches whenever they are displaying it on their platform their satellite platform so on a satellite they're going to show a different thing but whenever a match is being played on on their terrestrial platform you're going to get access to it so in case you have a master combo decoder, a strong decoder, or any FTA decoder that you are using, and you don't have an antenna port, maybe you are using a decoder that has an antenna port, you have an antenna port, you can actually tap in onto the signal on the terrestrial platform to get access to some of the matches that they're going to telecast on this platform. I mean, whenever you find out that there is either RF input or antenna ANT input, Plus the LMB ports, which means that you have both. You can get both platform on your satellite receiver or your receiver. All right. So in case you don't have this option on your decoder, you have only the satellite option. You have some channels on the satellite platform, numerous channels on the satellite platform that you're gonna get access to watch some of the matches. All right. But on a multi TV platform, there are no channel that is actually showing it unless you use a biscuit to unlock some of the channels and with a biscuit i can give you a biscuit here which is illegal or risk to do on my channel so all you got to do is to change your current satellite position from the multi tv angle to that of the my tv to get access to some of the channels that is available on the my tv platform so with my tv you can use a satellite dish ranging from 50 centimeters upwards. Any dish, any smaller dish that comes along with a set of decoders, you can actually use it to track. And they are on the northeast above the multi TV signal, which is 26 degrees. Multi TV is 28 on top of the multi TV, which is 26 degrees on the northeast. You're going to use this frequency that will be on your screen, which is 10804 horizontal 30k. So I have some list of matches that are going to telecast on these FTA channels. And I'm going to give you those FTA channels, exact channels that are going to telecast these matches. All right. So these are the matches they have already showed some few ones. We have Qatar, Ecuador, we have Senegal, Netherlands, we have France, Australia, Belgium, Canada, Switzerland, Cameroon. And we have Portugal, Ghana, which is on the 24th. We have Portugal. You have Qatar, Senegal, 25th. We have England, USA, 25th. We have France, Denmark on 26th. We have Spain, Germany, 27th. Cameroon, Serbia on 28th. We have South, South Korea, Ghana, 28th. We have Ecuador, Senegal, 29th. We have Wales, England, 29th. We have Tunisia, France on the 30th. We have Japan and then Spain. On the 1st of December, we have Ghana, Uruguay, 2nd December, and Cameroon, Brazil, on the 2nd of December. So at least if you are in West Africa and you are supporting all the teams in West Africa, 
that are representing in the World Cup, at least you're gonna get all their group stage matches to watch on this channel that I'm gonna outline here. All right. So after installing your my TV on your multi TV or any satellite receiver that you are using, after installing my TV having a stable signal on it, all you got to do is to perform brain scan to get all the channels that are available or around the uh, TP. So we have the exact TP that you're going to use. The TP will be on your screen, which is 10804 horizontal 30k30000. And you channel your dish. If you already have a stable multi TV signal, it's just above a multi TV signal a bit on your left side. Just raise it up on top of the multi TV signal and you're going to get it working. But make sure that you have the stable signal, not less than 50% to actually get the channels working. So we have these channels that are going to telecast. I can confirm that they have been showing some of the matches. All right. We have TVT Togo, which is on the, the same my TV platform, which is on the air frequency. If you want to track them separately, the air frequency is 12561, horizontal 30K. And we have RTS channel also on the my TV platform, which is on this frequency. 12520 horizontal 30k. The frequency will be on your screen, so you can just tap into the frequency and then if you want to track them separately. We have CRTV, which is the same frequency of the my TV 10804 horizontal 30k. We have CRTV sports, the same frequency. We have ORTB channel on it. So at least you're going to get access to some of the wake up matches. The listed matches I have given you, you are 90% assured of it that you're going to get access to watch some of it. All right. So that's it if you find the video at all. And when you like to do subscribe and you hit the bell icon, you lose absolutely nothing by subscribing. Thanks for watching. Peace.